Hey everybody, how we doing today? Another beautiful evening here in the Florida Keys and we're gonna do some fishing. <laughs> so let's get to it. So what we're doing is I'm hitting all my bait spots and seeing what's hiding in here. Hoping for them pilchards, but still pretty early. With the temps still being in the mid 90s, low to mid 90s, the uh, water temps are just too warm right now still, but Otherwise, see if maybe a school of uh, finger mullet, regular mullet, or anything else is uh, bundled up in here. So we'll keep looking. So these guys over here are uh, still searching for lobsters, even though this channel has been hit probably a hundred times since the mini season, and they've been wiped out and poached to nothing. But people are still diving it, and that kind of kills all the fishing in this channel right now just with all that mo uh, movement in the water that's just out of the ordinary so that kind of the reason why I'm not putting a lot of effort into uh, fishing right now until most of these lobster guys are gone and have given up and things get back to normal again well I just hit all my little bait spots and nothing hardly any glass minnows either so that's not good so We'll go move up a bit and uh, see if we can find a good spot on the channel and play around there. Got this nice lively pinfish there. So we can chuck this out. I'm just still catching bait, but I could run this out on the edge there. See if there's anything uh, hanging out and waiting for us. Unfortunately, I think it's going to be a lot of toothy critters, but that's okay. Uh, I think we got something on. Let it take it for a little bit. Uh-oh, where's it going? Where's it going? Oh, sharky shark. Don't break. Oh, let it go. Uh, still on. Still wants it. I think it's a cuda that finally bit through it and took everything. Well, toothy critters. Well, there's still a couple of uh, boats out diving out there, so that kind of kills that. I'm not going to waste my time over there. So I'm going to just cruise around, see if I can see any, any type of activity around. I've got a half dozen nice little pinfish, so that'll give us something to throw at them, plus some artificials. So let's do some scouting. All right, we're hooked up. All right, we are hooked up. What it is, I do not know, but it's a fish. Sun is set. No complaints here. Hail Mary. <laughs> oh, there goes my bobber. Oh, did it jump off? Do I just have a big thing of seaweed or is it stuck? Oh, I traded in a fish for a big chunk of seaweed. That sucks. All right, hook up again. Thinking tarpon. Second Hail Mary attempt. Yeah, this is the end of the magic hour. That seems to be the time for them. Pretty sure juvenile little tarpon. Uh, beautiful sunset. Pretty sure tarpon. Hail Mary number two. Let's see my bobber. Fill my leader. Uh oh. Didn't like that. Oh, it's gonna come up, gonna come up. Gonna come up. Ugh. Yeah. Come on, baby. I will let you go. Oh. Stay away from the anchor line. Stay away from the... I see color. 
And there we go. Nice little tarpon. Oh. I think I'm gonna release here. Keep him away from that anchor line. And whoa! There we go. Come on, baby, it's time. Enough already. Enough already. Hey, don't jump at me. Don't spear me with that hook. Oh, there's another tarp in there. Oh, dang it. Well, Hail Mary. <laughs> Well, happy to say we ended on a good note. I don't want to beat up on those juvenile tarpon too much. They're my uh, backup plan. Kind of like that little lobster spots that I have. If uh, I'm having a rough time everywhere else, I can rely on these spots to create some action. Uh, but I am seeing these uh, juvenile tarpon all over, so that's a good sign. Uh, Wide Street Pier, over here Shark Channel, over there by the harbor. So it's just like that they're starting to come about so I need to go check my spots out on the back country so that's something I could do this week as well uh, I think there's a nice little stretch so I might be able to do some uh, reef or blue water stuff so we'll get back to the fishing now uh, those guys are still hitting the lobster spot so it kind of kills the fishing in those areas but uh, if I go out to the reef they won't be really that much out there or if I go out to the wrecks and the blue water but uh, yeah some stuff to do so we'll see what we can uh, pull off tomorrow I think tomorrow's a windy day and then it gets calm after that for a few days so back to fishing thanks for watching and I'll see you next video bye